About time to get things going. Morning, Coil. What's up, man? Gym time, bro. Oh. Time to get warmed up with some dumbbells as we usually do. And then I'm gonna train some back today. Do some barbell rows. And then maybe some cable stuff. Probably some hex bar shrugs. It'll be good. Load of the dumbbells, go for it. And ask away, man. Oh, good. That's why we're here to make some gains and chat it up a little bit, man. All good. Yeah, build that back up with them rows. We're hitting biceps pretty hard, so I have to keep an eye on that when we're doing rows. Because it works with just teaming the bicep, it involves it, you know? But we'll get warmed up and go from there. Oh, yeah. But we did get some good WoW done today. We're gonna play more after we finally get into the PvP. The morning WoW grind is kind of just like, I don't know, just doing like the weekly stuff, knocking that out. Whoa. But Torgas is done for the week, so that's good. Torgas is fun, but it's good to be able to log in and just kind of immediately look for a PvP on both my characters. So that's where we, that's where we like to be right there. Be good stuff. Oh. I feel like I need more reps already. It's been like six days reps of what? Oh yeah. Got something coming? Yup. Little bit, little bit. Tightening up a little. Don't need to get, uh, you know, too lean, but that is the idea. Let's sharpen up a little bit, huh? Don't need to, don't need to go too crazy. But feeling's good still, so that's good. The mini cut's been very manageable so far. Not feeling too bad at all. Just gonna make sure I get some sleep and don't go too low on the calories, and then it's, it's just steady. Steady rolling, man. I think with WoW being as much fun as it is, that's, that's helped though. Help get me fired up. But pumping up the content, pumping out the arenas. Sunday. So it'll be a little while. My shorts, thanks. There are, there are games and game shorts. Get you some. 
Get you some. This will be alright, Antonio. Be smart about it, though. We have the good old games and game shorts, though. There we go. It's like, oh, you feel like you need more reps of at, in the workout, but it's only been six days of working out total? Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> oh, we'll, we'll, we'll still need some YouTube videos while we're gone. <laughs> but yeah, we'll see. If we can get a few ready while we're for the week, that'll be, that'll be fine. All right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Definitely want some videos while we're there. And quick edits are fine. I, like, I know you've got a lot of stuff to work with, so some quick edits would be fine. Yeah. I can send you more stuff, too. But quick edits of those arena sessions is fine. Like I said, the arena sessions are good candidates for quick edits. That could work. I do this sometimes on my back case. I kind of want to do some chest cables. Do some chest cables. We could do uh, some shoulders uh, as well. Like some rear delt stuff on the shoulders would be good. <laughs> Somebody said that would be good. Well, 22 pounds in a few months, nice, dude. Yeah, I'm right there with you, man. I probably dropped, I dropped from about 220 to um, about 197 in the mornings these days, so. Yeah, those weights, the, the, the green bar is only for Archer. He's, that's for the big dog. I don't mess with that, dude. That's for the big dog. Let's do these real light and see how it feels on my uh, pack. I, could, I think I could use the blood flow. How long to work out for per day? Uh, usually around two hours. I can work out for longer than that if I got time, but some, but you gotta kind of keep it tight on the schedule. Today we're getting in here late, so it might be probably around two hours still, but probably not too much longer than that because I gotta make sure we get back on them games. We'll see. twice a day yeah you just probably want to make sure you're getting really good recovery though I, I, I've done two workouts a day before I'd like to take a nap in between and stuff yep that's just gonna gotta make sure that you're taking proper care of your recovery on there you can even grab yourself a whoop to make sure that you're staying on board with that There's, the link is right there in the chat too yep and you're be good man but you're uh, really immersing in the web content.
Yeah. That's a little bit high. That's pretty good. Mm. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Definitely gotta get those going today. Been a bit, but we'll start light and work our way up. Get that form right, get that squeeze right. A little bit of, it's a, gonna be a back workout, but I'm gonna do a few chest cables in between, just to feel it. Just for fun. Uh, yeah, working out. Working out to working out. Are you are you back to gym streams in the morning for good now? I think this this time is about right. I mean, I mean, I the schedule will probably change at some point again, but uh, we have been streaming uh, games first. Then we then we get in the gym. It's just afternoon gym streams are fun, but it's really hot right now in the summer, and I. I kind of miss like a pretty good arena window, so trying to balance things out a little bit. But this is what we're doing right now, around this time. Usually a little earlier than this, but uh, yeah, this will be good for a little while, I think. This will be good. Have to add weight to those slowly. They're hard. Not to squeeze. But we have been doing barbell rows for a little bit. But I think they're they've always been really good to me. But uh oh, just haven't been doing as much. I'll get back into it though. Get a little bit of shoulders and chest in there for the sort of complete upper body pump. Uh, but yeah, this schedule I think is good. Kind of breaks. Breaks up my day with a little bit of exercise, which is nice. And you know, it's not quite as hot. It still gets pretty warm in the summertime, but it's not quite as hot. It's my gym, it is, it is. It's the garage gym, the games and games gym. Version one, pretty sick, huh? Pretty sick, I love it. We're here like every day, We're getting it in. Bit of shoulders. Keep things interesting. It's gonna be a big pumper day today, man. Slamming. Then arena this afternoon. Ideally, my main. Poor Gorgon needs cap too, but the main is the big dog. He's so strong right now. With that weapon? Oh my gosh. Cranking geeks.
Oh. Woo. Yeah. I mean, Warriors are probably doing the Monday anyway. The game's pretty fast anyway. I, mean, I was like, I was crushing down yesterday. I'll say you the clips so you can look at the bottom. Pretty nuts. I'll send you the clips though. Like I'll send you some some game footage today. For some quick edits. But yeah, man. Woo. Oh. So those videos where I'm sending you all the notes for the captains, are those like mid edits? Is that is that what we're doing with those ones? Those are kind of like that step up from a quick edit, but not quite a full edit. Since I'm kind of doing all the notes, is that how that works? Just want to clarify for the different kinds of content that we've got going on. Because I feel like those ones are like. Not a whole lot of editing is going on, just, but it, it does help for you to put it together for me, for sure. Like, a, like the most recent S-Fan one? Woo. Those mid-edits? Oof. Because we get it. Work on some more of those, but the quick edits will be fine, I think. Yeah, that one's huge. Huge! I should do some rear delties, too. With that. These rows. Another set of these, and we'll put them in a little bit, too. Oh, that's the name of the game for today's workout, just smashing this stuff. Smashing the roads all day long. Like bullets? Oh, okay. Okay, I was curious. Good to know. Ugh. I just don't know if we've seen, have we seen a mid edit yet? Have we done one of those yet? That's not a lot of equipment I'm keeping now. Not, not for this, at least. Maybe I should upkeep it more. Yeah. mid-edit. <laughs> thought it might be those ones, but okay. Alright. Put a team bit more right on this, I think. I like the way the form is feeling. I don't need to go crazy heavy, but she feels a little heavier. Holy crap. Gotcha, Quinn, gotcha. So 
this feels. So doing the like gym stuff, nice. Noise. Squat dead bench, that's good stuff, man. It's good stuff. Awesome. We'll keep it up, dude. Ugh, on the grind. And again tonight, that's a plan. That's a plan. If the arena's going for the, the afternoon session, it'll be awesome. Yeah, our standard schedule is morning gaming. Sort of later morning gym and then uh, come back for a longer gaming session afterwards yeah our piano sphere yeah hopefully hopefully if we can get some more uh, some more threes are going to be great more arcano spear action Pretty fun yesterday. We're doing pretty good. I feel I've been a blast. Just annihilating the damage meters. <laughs> Those good times. Get all rose, baby. Whoosh. BB Rose. I'm kind of selling grind today, man. It's one of those days. Threes tonight would be great, but yeah, I'm grinding today, I guess. It's getting the job done. That's kind of how the wow was, too. It's getting it done today.
Just getting to work today, man. You're right, Buck. Just getting to work, man. Just doing it. Whew. That's how it goes, man. I can definitely feel my traps still from doing the deadlifts, I think. They weren't real heavy, but they were, you know, they got activated, they got activated. Season two, yeah. On the grind, dude. On the grind. Good stuff. Good stuff. On the grind. Oh. We'll do a few of these while we're just getting started too. Start, start working these into the rotation here. I mean, that's not, that's not true. Um, I don't cycle simulants though, no. It's probably more like two, 200, 250. But, I don't really cycle them, no. That's not quite right. I've been spreading it out. I probably don't have more than 100 milligrams at a time. That's all right. Not quite, but yeah. Yeah, 100, not, probably not more than 100 milligrams at a time, but I, I have more than that during the day, yeah. But yeah, I don't, I've been, I've been liking the less caffeine at a time, but uh, a little more through the day kind of thing recently. It's been feeling good to me. That helps me. Keep doing my thing. A little teen spit in the morning, a teen spit even been in the afternoon. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Like a little bit of tea, you know? Oh. We'll probably wear some more games and game shorts for squats tomorrow. Yep. Yeah, probably will. Player 12 so far is going to suck. <laughs> that might suck. <laughs> but yeah, we got it. Let's get some good blessings and tear it up. Let's get rampage and easy run, easy run.
Oh. Yeah, soul forges might be spicy. Get yourself some games and games with them. Exclamation mark DBH, I like them. They're like my favorite. I ordered like three more pairs just recently. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. Here we go. Thumbnail? Sure. Noise. Noise. I'll check in a sec. I'm gonna bump this weight up a little bit. We're putting them little 25s on there, just a little something. Thumbnails are important stuff, huh? That text is kind of... Probably should squish that down a little bit so it's easier to read, right? Whew. It's like real compacted and stretched. But yeah, I think we're getting there. I think we're getting there. Uh. Have you been doing uh, any research on like effective thumbnails? I know you said you were, like you were looking up some stuff, like for inspiration. Have you looked up like effective thumbnails, like what works on YouTube? Because it really does kind of seem to me like there's so many like there's so much focus on like thumbnails and titles. You know, we might wanna we wanna do some research on that kind of stuff and see like what the trend is, right? And work on that. Ugh. Might be to our advantage. Because the content, the videos are fantastic. But you might have to kind of get those thumbnails and titles popping in order for them to get traction. Interestingly enough, you know? Something to think about. Let's just double up on the sets there. Oh. Might be one of those things to do, huh? thumbnails are like unfortunate but yeah the, the, the weight that's placed on this kind of intense I feel like right you don't want awesome videos that get skipped over because they don't fit the meta right or thumbnails yeah doing good turn yep yep that's what I've been doing for a little while now I don't really necessarily see vegetarian as like part of my identity, but I've, I've been really liking it, yeah. Yep. There we go. What's it take from shakes and beans? I don't really eat any beans, but I, I really do like uh, this uh, company called Corn, Q U O R N. That's probably like my favorite thing. I mean, I get like about 40 grams of protein from supplements a day, but most of it comes from food. So, it adds up. Tip you on. 
I mean, it's not like I haven't eaten beans before, I just don't... I don't like eating a ton of beans, it just doesn't make me feel the way I like to feel. I definitely have had beans before, but... And there have been times where I've had beans be more of like a... Be more of like a sort of staple of what I'm doing, but just... Haven't been doing it recently, and I think that's been actually, it's been okay. Yeah. Let's see, what do you want to eat? Yeah, corn is good. Q-U-R-N, it's good stuff. Good quality protein. Plant-based. Yeah, you don't have to eat meat. In general, you don't have to eat meat to make gains either, though. I've been feeling really good on the plant-based diet. And that interesting, what's weird about it is it has made both bulking and dieting more comfortable. Which I, I sort of expected to be one or the other, not both. Right? But it has been both, which is curious. Very curious. But cool. Very neat. meals. My calories are pretty trim right now, so I really only have one meal with that these days, but definitely could add more. But keeping the calories tight right now. Sharpening up a bit. Feeling good though. But definitely keeping it tight. Not familiar, Jan. You can give me the the quick scoop, though. What you find interesting about it? The quick scoop. Yeah, same thing with titles, Quayla. Finding uh, finding sort of thumbnail and title sort of little meta, right? That could help, I think, a lot. I mean, I guess like the logo that we've been using is the Games and Games or like the one on my Twitch channel, but not really. I guess we can make one. I like the Games and Games logo, that's good stuff. Hey, go for it, Quaylen. Go for it. You could edit with the, with the title in mind or edit and then have it come up with a title that makes sense. We could work on that, yeah. What's up, Brenner? Gaming setup's not the garage, no. Nope. 
Yeah, 2K calories is pretty low calories, Slaw. Yeah. Only works when linked to your channel. I mean, maybe. But depends on what, what functionality you're trying to learn, right? But then, like, surely you can recognize trends and be like, wow, and stuff, right? Oh, well, thank you, man. Appreciate it, dude. Yeah. He's studying and advocating carnivore diet, which is obviously plant based. Yeah. I mean, you, you can probably try that too, see if you like it, you know? Once again, Joe, somebody being on Joe Rogan, to me, almost is like, almost like a bad thing for their credibility. <laughs> just because just cause there's so much craziness, like, that, that, that show is designed to be like, interesting and entertaining, but not necessarily scientific, right? And it's a cool, it's a cool podcast, but it's like, this guy was on Joe Rogan, I'm like, oh, okay, so it's probably some kind of like, off the wall thing. Maybe, I don't know, yeah. Here we go. Yeah, you don't have to link it, you don't have to link it to my channel, it's something to learn from, right? Yeah, so maybe you take some time to focus on building muscle instead of keeping your calories so low, right? See you, dude. I, I just mean like learning the general patterns of like titles that work and stuff, you know? Oof. Yeah. Sure, Quaylen, yeah. Give it a shot. Sure. Or we could put the wow, like show wow Shadowlands on there. That could be good too. That might even be better. Yep. Try 2500. You could try 2200 instead. Maybe if you want to try that. If you were sort of hesitant about making a making it that big of a jump, yeah. That's cool, Quinn. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, spend some time trying to build muscle instead of, you know, stalling at low fat or low calories and not losing that much fat, right? Because you and I are almost the same weight, right? But because I've spent some time building muscle, I'm losing two pounds a week eating 2,500 calories, right? System and getting stronger, build muscle. Might be fun for you. Let's change the pace from the restriction, right? Could be good. What's up, dude? Getting a little bit of a uh, back day in today. Trying to do some rows. It's been a while, but I'm feeling pretty good. Feeling pretty good overall. It's a grind day, man. It's a grind day today. Just quietly getting after it. Oh. Knocked out some grind on the, the wild side of things, so. Now we're getting back to it. 
Back to it. Uh. Oh. Oh, you yeah. got it. Headlight rounds? No, it's, uh, I'm not going all the way down the ground with them. What am I doing here? Those need to be over there. It's fine. Space now. Uh, pretty sound right now? Yeah. I think it sounds like it'd probably be a good time to up the calories a little bit and try to improve your training a bit, yeah. I have played Doom Eternal, yeah. It was fun, but WoW is the main jam these days. That Doom was fun, I, I checked it out recently. Can you get those lifts up, E? Yeah. That sounds good. I mean, you're off to a great start, but you're going to be able to build your strength and your muscle better by eating a little bit more calories. Which I think will be fun for you. Kind of like shift the focus, shift the perspective a little bit. Yep. How much time necessary to rest when you set? It depends on what your goals are. One of your uh, rest times are one of the things to play with. Yeah, the Doom soundtrack is awesome. I just think it, I think it, it might be uniquely copyrighted I, from my, what I understand. Like, I don't know if you can just listen to Doom music on stream. Like, it'd be sick if you could, but yeah, I'm not sure if you can. Don't actually know. Me and Coil would love to use it in videos and stuff too. I just don't know if you're allowed to do that. Oh, just don't know. Yeah. From, from my initial research, it seems like no. But yeah, I wish. I wish. Or. Main man hands, thanks for the prime, man. Big flex, more. welcome back, dude. Thanks for keeping that prime rolling here, man. It means a lot, dude. Thank you, man. Well, good to see you. Hope all is well. Just doing our thing, man, as usual. On the grind. That's a little bit of a grind day. Just put your head down and get the work done today. Hopefully, we can get some arenas pumping later. That's just where we're at right now. It's working. Uh. I don't, want to, I don't want anything weird in my pre workout. I'm good. I'm good. When do I get the Gauntlet Slider set up? Sometime. <laughs> Sorry. Sometime. Eventually. Sometime. I just use the bodybuilding.com signature series, which is sold out, which sucks. It's good stuff, hopefully they get back in stock here pretty soon. Oh. It's on the list of things to do, Coyle. Thanks for your patience on that one. It's on the list.
yeah, the, the bot doesn't like that, Yon. You can tell me what you're, uh, what you're interested in about it, but... Yeah. Different ways of eating, that's for sure, depending on what you, what you want to do. Sure, Quinn. Is it usable by any means words? Yeah. Yep. Yep. Might even need to experiment with it as carrion just for the uh, the crit buff, the crit damage buff. I really like massacre though. Massacre is so nice for the fast-paced games. Being able to execute is nice. Maybe the pressure of Ren could be nice too. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. It's just different, different play style. But yeah, I mean, I don't know, man. Massacre is pretty good. Massacre is real good. But could experiment with Red a bit too. It's big bleed pressure. Big crit damage. Oh. Could be good. Could be good. Especially as warriors lean into more crit with the new legendary and stuff. We're pretty sick. Oh. Yeah, I'm pretty. I'm sure the Google XLR is sick. I'm glad they got one. It's just time's a little tight right now, and I'm not really wanting to take time off screen to set it up right now. But yeah, I feel ya. One of these days we'll get it going. Maybe if we take like a day to get settled after vacation, that could be something I do. Something like that. Oh. What's, what's that thing, Brunk? How did you get it? Just one of the one of the little freaky hand mounts? How do you get that thing? Congrats on it. Oh. Yep, yeah, just, just grooving right now, yep. Yeah. Oh. oh, Tormentors, yeah. Every other odd hour? It's every other odd hour or every other hour. I've only ever seen it one time on my main. I've never seen it on, on the Horde. Oh, sorry, other way around. I've only seen it one time on my Horde, never seen it on my main, so I, I didn't get to make my Legendary, my big one this week, because I just, just haven't got lucky to see it, I guess. It's kind of weird, but yeah, okay. So, so every other hour, okay, yeah. See, some got a craft today? No, I, I haven't got beat up a craft because I can't get those freaking tormentors. <laughs> so it's every odd hour, but then somebody said it was an, on an even hour this time around. So maybe this is on PST. It's even hours. I don't know. It's weird. Weird. Well, you definitely need text on the thumbnail, yeah. Usually. Maybe not, but I don't know, maybe. But yeah. I think having some text on there is, yeah. Yep. Yeah. But you can look at some of the videos that are on the channel and look at some of the thumbnail and text combos and title combos and uh, kind of see what's been working for us, what's worked for some of the videos and what's not. Because I don't, I don't, I really don't fully get it, right? But I'm just kind of keep posting good vids and see how it goes. Interesting. 
So for Central Pacific, it's on even numbers. Okay, I'm about to look out for that then. But I've been there on even hours and it doesn't do anything. It's not something spawn, so I don't. I have no idea. I have no idea. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. You mean expanding? Cool. That's fun. Good stuff. I guess expanding does usually mean you're expending a little bit too, right? Those two usually go hand in hand. Makes sense to me, man. Makes sense to me. What's up, Steely? Makes sense to me, that's cool. Oh. Makes sense to activate shoulders for training because I don't feel the workout like chest or arms and shoulders are my weak side. Uh, you can do little dumbbell presses, you can do little lateral raises. You'll see me doing a lot of those. I do a lot of lateral raises anyway during my workout too. These little guys are also for shoulders right here. These little dudes. A uh, little chest support and uh, rear delt rows. Or even flies. Oh. small little muscle back there. Really does, really can't feel it, the rear delt guys. Oof, man. Woo. Gotta do it though. Gotta get them little rear delts growing, man. The shoulders growing in general. You can do the chest support thing. All that could be interesting for you, because I'm with you, man. I can feel my shoulders when I train them, but they need a lot of work, so. I can sympathize with that. But, you know, we've been putting in a lot of work, <laughs> so. I think I might be seeing some some positive effects. But there's a lot of work left to be done. That's pretty normal though. Pretty standard with anything. There's always more work to be done. It's always improving to be made. Let's keep doing it.
Maybe like one more of those. We'll go up again. TFL, what's that? Super sword TFL in one leg, every session. Where's that? <laughs> I mean, if you're just getting back into it, I would imagine there's kind of little things that might feel weird. Right, so what is that? <laughs> side of the hip, upper thigh. And here? Yeah, that, that gets side for me too. Probably some mobility stuff. Yeah. Probably just more mobility stuff. I could benefit from that too, I think. But yeah, it happens to me too. My left hip does get pretty tight. Oh. Yeah, it doesn't, it doesn't really get hurt. It doesn't hurt after, but it does get, it just gets a little tight during. And we're like, thanks for the prime, man. Big flex for you. Welcome aboard, dude. Glad to have you, man. Beast mode. Thank you, dude. Pumping up them subs for the day. It means a lot, man. Thank you. Hello. Hello. Hello Neeners. Yes, sir. Get my, head, my little earbud out so I can hear you. Hi. Hello. Can we come out right now? Yeah. Hey, little tins. Yeah, DD, he's not here this time. Oh, no, DD, he's going to work. He'd be working. Huh? Huh? Thanks. Little mister. Where are you going, guys? Hi, everyone. Mom's here. Well, hang out with Archer. Watching my getting her, boy. Getting her play date in with Archer. That's right. You going to work on the fan? The fan is on. <laughs> Woo! The fan giving you chills. And you know, thanks for the three months. Welcome back, dude. Oh, you got it, man. We keep on popping. We'll show me some bad day today. Or real life. Yeah, make, yeah, make sure he turns that fan off before he starts working on it. You can turn it off. Don't we have to unplug it first? Not really. Okay. Can you turn it off? There, there. Well, it's turned up. Okay. You work on the heater instead? That would be, be a fine plan. There's like a little little space here on the corner. Did you get that for me? I'm going to pop that back on. Oh, man. What's Jenny up to? She's go. getting ready to run hands. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Nice, Lance. Good job. Did you check this out, Arthur? Did you Enjoy the vault. So the vault's a favorite part of it. Sorry, guys. I love it. Those levels are fun. Because you're all beefed up at that point. Nice. One more set here and then we'll bump it up a little. I didn't like it, Albert. Okay. What's this, buddy? You guys stay over there real quick? That guy. Then you gotta do a little set. Yeah? Yeah. There's no mirrors out here right now. I need to find that. Oh, this is the wrong. We have to leave it on for daddy unless you're doing your hair. You gotta be on him now. Yeah, when the weights are moving, you gotta get a hold of him. You gotta get a hold of him when the weights are moving.
Fix the fan for Dad.
Brain repairman out there. Woo. Oh man. You gotta get yourself some of them games and game shorts, they're good stuff. That's what I'm talking about, straps, yeah. That, that's what I started the conversation, yeah. Is asking how to use straps. Your front end nice, which you have to play over now, so if they can't train grip at all. Yeah, I mean, that's, now's probably not a good time to train grip if you're, if you're like all torn up. I probably won't be competing until next year. A little mini cut right now, but it's not going to be like a extended thing. I'm probably going to finish the mini cut at the end of this month, and then just get back to work on the primary gains. We'll see, though. We'll see, but probably not until next year. I don't think my physique has that much improved since last time, but we'll see. Got a lot of work to do. But a little summer mini cut makes sense across a lot of parameters right now, so we're doing it. Feels pretty good too. Sounds good, man. Yep. Yeah, just get healthy, man. I don't think you got the right idea. I'm glad you're doing well, though. Yep. Let's get back in the swing of it. Plenty of time to make gains. Just get healthy. Yep. Woo! The tad today. Good stuff, money. The tad. I'm probably not going to go any heavier than this today, just as we acclimate to the rows again, but this is good. Don't get it. Don't need to go all heavier than this anyway, without yanking the weight around.
rocking to this music, Nina? I rock to music. No, I said you're rocking out to the music. Oh, uh, no, the motor. Oh, okay. There's a motor around here. Gotcha. Tell me what time is it? It is 10:45. Yeah, horn is the number one. Q U O R N. But like tofu. Like there's a brand called Gardein. But yeah, corn, the Q-U-O-R-N is like my favorite thing. There's corn and, and like, if you don't feel like cooking, there's corn and, you know, microwave veggies, frozen veggies, good to go. No, DKs are good, Frosty Ks are really good right now. Warriors are also really good, but yeah. Frosty Ks are really good. Uh, you can do that. You just, gotta, you just gotta learn how to group people in and pop all your cooldowns. That's all. Oh. Grip blind, pop everything. <laughs> oh. Get somebody on your team that can stun out of your blind. Let's go nuts. Get some rice, that's like quick rice, you can microwave that probably. Cream of rice if you wanted to. I've been eating a lot of oatmeal recently, that's been really good. Like quick oats is good digestible carbs, doesn't take any cooking. Yeah. You can do it, man. Wish me better for a newer player, but also good for content. Both. Both are good. I mean, I can help you more learning Warrior than I can DK, but at this point, but I mean, if you like playing, if you DK seems interesting to you, then just go for it, man. Go for it. I think, I mean, Frosty K is pretty straightforward. Yeah. Warrior is not overly complicated either, but, you know. Are you okay here? Yeah. Just do my thing. Yeah, stop. Yeah. The motor turns off, Dad. Our turn can turn it off. Yeah. Over back workout? Oh, it's painful doing enough back stuff. Well, that's a different sort of question. Like if you if you're injured and got injured, you might have to talk to like a physical therapist to figure out what kind of upper back exercise you can do that would hurt you. Because there's some there's some good back training exercises like like shrugs and rack pulls, deadlifts, different types of rows. But you definitely have to find one that uh, works with your injury. But thank you for your service, though, man. Yeah. So I got hurt, but I, I would imagine there's some stuff that you could do, right? But yeah, you're gonna have to probably talk to somebody who knows what they're talking about and get with you on your unique situation, right? Probs. Right, that's a couple more of these. Definitely pumped to do some rain today. My main warrior is jacked right now. It's 
squeaky tins. Can you go back What's the new guy? Well, come look at the motor now. What's the new guy? Look at the motor now. I think it's that's the way you want it to be. <laughs> Woo! One of my macros, not wild macros. My, my calories are pretty low right now, so take it with a grain of salt, but they're 300 carb, 145 protein, and like 50, 60 fat. They're pretty, it's, it's a pretty aggressive little cut, and I've been feeling good on it, so I'm keeping it going. I'm not gonna do it for real long, but yeah. Pretty tight. Pretty tight macros compared to what I usually eat, but. It's like a thousand calorie deficit. <laughs> oh. Doing about two pounds a week weight loss, so that's pretty cool. Shredding up a little bit. Not gonna do it for a whole lot longer, but like I said, it's been feeling pretty good, so let's keep it rolling. Swing that under your hips a little bit. I don't know if I've done that in particular, but I've done exercises like that before. Yeah. Interesting. I, I do like a kind of a cable pull down, I feel like it would be probably similar. It sounds like I'd do something very similar to a straight arm pull down. Which I like those a lot. Might do some more of those today. Weave some of those in with the chest. Little tins. I'm a fan of his motor. I'm gonna do a few lifts before you go. A couple lifts before you go. You need your barbells. There you go. Racked up. So it's, a, it's you get like the like on the cable, and you have the like a little bar. And you kind of lean over, stretch your lap, then you pull it in like that. Keep your arms pretty straight. I like that a lot. Does it feel good being uh, so relatively low in protein? Yeah, it does. Yeah, I'd rather have more carbohydrates to have better like energy and pumps in the gym and bring my protein down a little bit. Just feels comfortable. Cause you don't need that much protein, you know what I mean? 
I feel like the extra carbohydrates to train harder in the gym are gonna help you retain muscle mass more than just more dietary protein. Because you're still getting enough, right? So, nice pilot. Yes, you did it. Nice. What's that? Oh, that's mostly carbohydrates right there. Yeah, so I've, 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 what I've done is I've moved a bunch of, a good chunk of that protein into carbs. Oh, nice, friend, nice. Cool. Maybe we'll get on the gaming stream and see you a bit late today. That's okay. Maria doesn't really fire up until later, but make sure we get the workout in. Oh man. Yeah. Look at your cheeks. Get back in there. Nice and easy. Take the proper precautions as well. Because, oh, still a thing, for sure. Definitely still a thing. The Delta thing is kind of spooky. So take your precautions, but get back in the groove and ease into it. You got this. Enjoy the process. And you can even need to do some of your exercise at home too, push-ups, crunches. Go for walks, runs, just to keep working on your fitness. Yeah, a little more body mass, push some more weight around, yeah. When we go on vacation, I'm probably not going to the gym. I thought I was going to, but maybe that's not a good idea. So I'll be doing the opposite. I'll be doing the, the instead of going back to the gym, I'll be taking a, like a week off the weights. Just doing like, you know, body weight stuff at the house and maybe going for walks and runs and stuff. Going to the beach. Yeah. Ugh. But yeah, I might have to hold off. Let's just, whatever. Let's just get checked outside. We'll be alright. Ready? Yeah, it'll be a little family reunion kind of thing. It'll be fun. But yeah, we got the gym will be interesting, but there's plenty of ways to stay active. Why not going? Uh, the, the, the Delta thing. I got a feeling that a lot of people in North Carolina might not be vaccinated. <laughs> and we got a bunch of littles who are at the, the beach house and I don't know if I want to be going into an environment where people are going to potentially be not vaccinated and not following the rules and potentially bring something back to the family with my, you know, elderly family members and young family members. Probably not. So. Probably not. Yeah, it's just probably not worth it. I can take a week off the gym. Yeah. Just go do some push-ups in the morning and do some crunches and go for like a short run and then... You gonna do push-ups? Push-ups too, you can do push-ups with that. And then uh, just, you know, dig a bunch of holes in the, in, at the beach. Make a bunch of big sand castle every day. Just lie down on here, let me support you. Do push-ups. There, I have hands on here. 
Yeah. Probably just gonna be smart about it. One hand right here. There we go. Good job, Archer. Nate as well. Then maybe maybe a week. Take it easy, it could be fine. We've been training pretty hard for a while, so it'll be like a nice like break be and before we begin the next phase, whatever it is. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be adding calories and trying to get stronger and build muscle again. There's a small chance that I just keep dieting and do a little, little bit of competition this year, but I don't think so. Tracking apps, I use my fitness pal. Yeah, if you haven't seen our video, you can type exclamation mark fat loss. Watch that video. That's a cool one. But yeah. Probably should not die down and compete this year. Probably should just get back to bulking and make some gains, I think. Probably. Probably should. Buckle down. But you'll see. I mean, I can stay relatively lean and still build out of this deficit, so. You're fine. Yep, different haircut back then, yep.
for sure. So that's what we'll be doing. Add some calories and get back to work, I'm pretty sure. I don't think there's any reason for me to do a big diet right now. Like I said, like there's no reason to like to, to continue the diet to try to get competition lean. I just don't think I've really made that much different like improvement, right? But yeah, I mean, we've been doing pretty good for about a year now, at least. I don't think 2019 was big for gains. I think half of 2020 wasn't that great for gains. Second half of 2020, and so far 2021 has been pretty good, so. It's been one good year, another good year of bulking and working hard is probably make a difference for the physique, right? Yep. Is the 70% of body weight in grams of protein? Said, yeah, that's that, I mean. 0.6 grams of protein per pound of lean body mass. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Sounds about right. It sounds very familiar. I think I might know who you're talking about. Ugh. I think I might know who you're talking about. Probably quite the reputable source. Oh, shit. You're probably owns it wow too. Oh yeah. Probably owns it uh World of Warcraft. Oh Whew. here we go. Mm. Bet he got ranked one last season. And the season before that too. Oh. Cheater and sells away protein though, not a real vegan. Oh. I don't know, I, just, I like the ISO pure protein a lot, it's been feeling real good. Making me feel nice, getting me through that diet nicely. Oh. Woo! Man oh man. Man oh man. This back attack is going quite nicely today. <laughs> yeah, is it? It's probably still like the milky consistency, though. That's not really. The thing about isopure that I like is that it's like the sort of juicy. No, that's so the cool about isopure is it's it's juicy. It's more like a like a fruit drink. I like it. It's unique for what I need right now. It's unique. It's, it's, it's exactly what I'm, what I'm looking for. Whew. It's nice. Mm. All right, the lamb, the lamb the clock. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. How long have you been doing the plant thing? I'm a little more tired than I thought today.
you get nauseous if you don't eat for 12, 15 hours since last meal? Uh, not really. Like if you, I mean, if you finish your eating for the day at 6 p.m. and you wake up and don't eat until 6 to 9 a.m. and don't feel nauseous. But if you don't eat for 12 waking hours, that might feel uncomfortable. Not nauseous, though. I usually eat, you know, from about 6 a.m. to 6, uh, 6 p.m. It's just kind of how it goes. Kind of how, how it ends up working out for me. I might be about done here, man. I might be about done. Could, could keep grinding for another 15 minutes. Make it a nice full two hours, but yeah. The fun thing about doing a bunch of barbell rows, kind of gets the job done. I think I'm just a little tired today, though, too. A little, a little tired today. TBC retail to the gym. Probably gonna be doing the Shadowlands arenas. Um, but, but I think actually S Fan, S Fan is doing a. Uh, it's supposed to be doing pug raids at some point today. So, depending on what time those are going on, I'd like to get in on that. Yeah, S Fan owns. We gotta figure out what time those, uh, those. Like gruels and Magtheridon pugs are happening, and then I try to get in on that. But uh, yeah, I definitely want to do arena today. My my main warrior in Shadowlands is a monster right now, so it's really fun to play. Like warriors are good. The pace of arena is pretty fast, and my warrior got some pretty nasty gear this you know this Tuesday. He got the weapon, then I was able to buy the uh, chest piece, and I got my new legendary. That, I mean, that combination is just really fun in arena right now. So, yeah, I kind of want to get in the, on the arenas today. But if we have TBC stuff going on, I might, I might be up for that too. Might be down. I know he and Jacob were putting in some work yesterday. Jacob was grinding TBC all day yesterday. Uh, Tyler's definitely stronger than me. <laughs> what are your shackles as a warrior? Well, I was talking about this a little bit earlier today. The shackle trinket can, um, it can be dispelled. It can be line of sighted. Like, like if you start casting and then they line you, it'll go on cooldown. Um, so you need to have an understanding of what the trinket does and what can prevent it. So you want to use it when those target is vulnerable and they don't have like interrupts for the trinket, like a stun or a fear, and it's anything that can stop the cast. So you want to probably cross CC to use it. You want to use it when the spells are either down or unavailable. Decurses completely remove the whole thing and stop the cast. A dispel will just dispel the effect. So sometimes you can use one that gets dispelled, then you use the next one, or the other two, and blast somebody with it. But yeah, situations of cross CC where, they can't, where the, you can't have the cast stopped or dispelled are good. Natural bodybuilding is real, yeah. I mean, you, you can absolutely bodybuild and work out and have fun with that, with that journey without incorporating drugs. Absolutely. It's not as like, like flashy because the physiques aren't quite as freaky. But I mean, you can absolutely work out and make games without drugs, yeah. And compete too. Oh. Most people were, we had complaining about nausea on plant-based at high sugar intake. Ever track how much sugar I get daily? I mean, I track everything. The only sugar I really get in my diet is from the, the cyclic, the highly branched cyclic dextrin that I take. Yeah. I've heard natural just means testosterone, no HDH and bodybuilding circles kappa. I mean, you probably have heard all kinds of dumb shit. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. Oh yeah, I eat fruit too, that's true. But yeah, not a lot of refined sugar. But yeah, there's sugar in fruit, yeah. So there's that too. Yeah. But yeah, there's that. That's true. Usually I have some fruit for dessert. 
have that after I eat my, my dinner. Have some, have some strawberries these days. Those are pretty good. Strubs, getting the job done. Strubs to get dubs, baby. Well, you don't, you don't have to have sugar in it. yogurt, I guess, right? Helps an extra testosterone when you get older. I mean, don't take medicine you don't need is basically. Like if, you, if your testosterone ain't working right and you need to stay healthy, to go ahead. But I mean, that would be the end of competing at, you know, in bodybuilding probably, at least, at least in natural bodybuilding, right? Some fruits have surprisingly high sugar content. And where that, there's nothing wrong with sugar. You have to, I mean, just gotta tr track your calories. Fruit sugar is good stuff, but you don't need to be afraid of sugar anyway. Just, just a source of energy, source of calories. Sugar is not evil, but I mean, like what, eating a, a bunch of foods with refined sugar is not something that makes me feel good. Sugar's fine. Fruit sugar is fine. It's fine. All right, I think we're about done, boys. Oh, I'll see you guys in the gaming stream, but that, that'll that'll be good for today's back day. Not too shabby. Appreciate the love. Thanks for tuning in. Let's uh, swap over and see if we can get some arenas rolling. All right? Thanks for watching. See you soon. Peace.